Well, I'm not really worried. I'm not hand wringing over this, but you mentioned the right thing, Karen. The rates now are at 310. Okay, that was not the case, you know, six months ago, and so that does put valuation constraint. We think 16 and a half times is kind of it. That's about as high as you can go when rates are at 310. That would be slightly below where we're trading today on a forward 12-month basis in terms of where earnings are 173. The difference between now and a year ago is that a year ago we still had tax to look forward to. We still had a lot of this leverage in the earnings. So uh, unfortunately, he is saying that the stock market rally is over and that we are going to see a correction. And if he is right, I am going to say that this might be the time to finally invest in crypto. Uh, unfortunately, prices were cheaper, um, so you might want to wait for another dip. But if we do head into a uh, recession with the U.S. and global stock markets, I do feel like crypto assets are going to be very attractive. And if you haven't got a Coinbase account or a Robinhood, I think this is the time where you should consider setting one up. Uh, you can click on the links below and starting to follow the market. Um, I wouldn't buy in all at once. I would definitely use something called dollar cost averaging to get into this market. But um, if the bull market is slowing down, uh, I would definitely consider taking more of a cash position and also picking up commodities like crypto and precious metals. Um, but I'm still going to stay with about 20 to 30 percent stocks and uh, slowly uh, make some crypto acquisitions if it goes below 200 billion market cap. But um, definitely do think cash right now is the is is the best position to be to be on to take advantage of these dips um, but let me know your thoughts on this and i will talk to you guys soon